Marie Curie, pioneer of radioactivity and scientific discovery. Born Maria Sklodowska on November 7, 1867, in Warsaw, then part of the Russian Empire, Marie Curie grew up in a family of teachers who emphasized education despite political oppression. Denied access to universities as a woman, she attended clandestine flying university classes before moving to Paris to study at the Sorbonne. There, she earned degrees in physics and mathematics, supporting herself through tutoring and enduring poverty, often subsisting on bread and tea. In 1895, Marie married physicist Pierre Curie, beginning a groundbreaking partnership. Inspired by Henry Becquerel's discovery of uranium rays, she coined the term radioactivity and identified thorium's radioactive properties. With Pierre, she discovered and isolated two new elements, polonium, named after her homeland, and radium. Their work earned them the 1903 Nobel Prize in Physics, shared with Becquerel, making Marie the first female Nobel laureate. After Pierre's tragic death in 1906, she continued her research, winning the 1911 Nobel Prize in Chemistry for isolating pure radium becoming the first person to win Nobels in two fields. During World War I, Curie pioneered mobile X-ray units, Petites Curies, to treat wounded soldiers, training 150 technicians and operating equipment herself at the front lines. Her efforts saved countless lives by enabling surgeons to locate bullets and fractures, though she refused to patent her discoveries, ensuring widespread access to the technology. Curie founded the Radium Institute, now Curie Institute, in Paris, fostering interdisciplinary research in radioactivity and medicine. Despite her fame, she faced financial struggles and gender bias, relying on donations like the gram of radium gifted by U.S. supporters. Her work laid the foundation for radiotherapy and nuclear physics, though prolonged radiation exposure caused a plastic anemia, leading to her death on July 4, 1934. Curie's legacy includes Scientific firsts, only person with Nobels in two sciences, first female professor at the Sorbonne. Medical advances, radiotherapy for cancer and X-ray technology. Gender equality, a symbol of women's intellectual prowess, inspiring generations. In 1995, she became the first woman interred in Paris's Pantheon on her own merits. Her story is one of immense personal sacrifice, groundbreaking discovery and the unwavering belief in the power of science to improve the human condition.